Interactive teacher. Presence. Ancient Roman architecture. Hi, I'm Martin. I am here to speak about ancient Roman architecture. But before I will tell you about the Roman Empire. It was one of the largest and most extensive in the world's history. It dominated most of Europe, Asia and Africa territories. Rome was founded along the Tiber River, between the 1st century BC, flourished and dominated great civilizations, such as Egypt and Greece, to succumb in the 4th AC century due to strong internal political crisis. And finally because of the unstoppable barbarian invasions. Although it is true the Romans developed an architecture with its own identity. Triumphal Arch This had great influence from other contemporary cultures empire. Such as Egypt and Mesopotamia, but mainly ancient Greek influence. But unlike the latter, Romans didn't take the aurea scale within their buildings. The Roman principle was monumental, so that all the buildings should be well above the human scale. But beyond their architecture, Rome was noted for its contribution to civil and military engineering. They developed more sophisticated building systems, including columns. But developing its own version, the composite order. Blending different architectural style trends into one. Watchtower. The walls of the buildings were much thicker and stronger than those used by the Greeks. They were built with mortars including concrete, brick, stone and wood. They were classified in opus reticulatum. Composed of volcanic shaped diamond rock break. Opus insertum. Mixed with cement mortar stones with very smooth finishes. Opus testaceum. Wall with oven cooked bricks. Opus cementitium. Mortar stones and debris that have the appearance of that concrete. Another architectural element was the boat, used in their war memorials. Aqueducts Allowed to transport water from city to city, dodging all kinds of landforms. And bridges. Arch of the barrel vault. From the arc derived the barrel vault that allowed. The construction of tunnels and canals. The transport of water for various human activities was Rome's greatest engineering achievement. Besides sewage. Allowed to drain local marshes and remove the waste from the cities. Roads also were created from the same concept. The best known is the Appian Way. Layers of the Roman Road. The construction process considered distinct layers. Rock level. Sand and mortar. Mortar. Mix sand, lime and water. Masonry. Masonry. It consists in building walls by manual placement of bricks, rocks and volcanic rocks. Pavement Sidewalk and ditch From the vault, the Romans developed the growing vault, which corresponds to two intersecting vaults. They also developed the vault quarter sphere. 
that eventually gave way to the dome. Both the Roman house, as the urbanization of the cities, influenced so that even today you can see these same ideas. Aqueduct Circus Racing horse carts were held. Foreign It was the center of the city, surrounded by commercial and public buildings. Temple Here the venerated statue of the god was kept by the city. Arch of Triumph Bobs Here they took baths and did gymnastics. Theater Wall Built with ashlar stone, protecting the city. Amphitheater Gladiator fights were held. From now on search your city and surrounding architectural or engineering contribution arising from Rome. This has been a contribution of Interactive Teacher. Subscribe to this channel and you will be able to access more resources. Goodbye. See you.